Air pollution carries significant risk to human health and children are particularly vulnerable. The invisible pollutants inside our buildings can lead to much higher pollution levels. However, work by Ishan Tripathi, a high school student and in the class of MIT 2023, and Joseph Lequatre of Cornell University seeks to draw attention to the risk of indoor air pollution to children's health. Indoor air pollution affects adults and children differently. Children spend most of their time indoors in the child breathing zone, an area defined as being up to one meter from the floor. This means that seemingly harmless activities in the home, such as laying carpets or painting rooms, can have a different impact on children and thus cause serious health issues. Current ventilation systems work on the assumption of equal distribution of pollutants. Through their research, Tripathi and Laquatra have shown that different pollutants can occur in different layers in the air. They also found that when pollutants such as dust are disturbed, they can be resuspended in the air. The health problems caused by indoor air pollution are severe, but also avoidable. One of the best methods of prevention is proper ventilation. When combined with greater awareness and understanding of the risks, these simple measures are sufficient enough to help reduce risk to children of exposure to indoor air pollutants.